A local resident sits near her apartment building, as police officers stand, as Russia's attack on Ukraine continues. In Lysychonsk, Luhansk region Ukraine June 2, 2022. Reuters Serhi Nuznenko. Oleg Kadyrov, 29, installs new windows in an apartment destroyed by Russia's attacks on Urban, outside Kyiv, Ukraine June 2, 2022. Reuters Edgar Su. A local resident walks, as his neighbor's house burns after shelling in Lysykansk, Luhansk region Ukraine June 2, 2022. Reuters Serhi Nuznenko. A girl looks on at a display of Russian weapon systems used in their attacks, outside St. Michael's Cathedral in Kyiv, Ukraine May 29, 2022. Reuters Edgar Su. Local residents stay inside an underground shelter in a town that had been occupied by Russian troops in the outskirt of Kharkiv, Ukraine June 1, 2022. Reuters Ivan Alvarado. A family reunification takes place when a woman carrying a baby reacts after evacuating from Russian troop-occupied Kupiansk town in a bus convoy on the outskirts of Kharkiv. Ukraine May 30, 2022. Reuters Ivan Alvarado. Vladimir Mihailovich, a solar plant manager, walks next to a crater after shelling hit the station that was producing 2.5 megawatts of power in the town of Marefa on the outskirts of Kharkiv, Ukraine May 28, 2022. Reuters Ivan Alvarado. A man smiles as he sits in front of a destroyed house in Vilkivka, Ukraine, May 25, 2022. Reuters Ivan Alvarado Ukrainian children Andrei, 12 and Valentine, 6, stand in a foxhole as they play Ukrainian military near their houses in the village of Stoyanka, in Kiev region, Ukraine May 22, 2022. Reuters Gleb Garanich Ala Berzovska and her sons Andrei and Alexei are seen inside of a shelter at a local school in Slovyansk, Donetsk region, Ukraine, May 27, 2022. More than one million children have fled Ukraine to neighboring countries in the less than two weeks since Russia started its invasion of Ukraine. The head of the United Nations Children's Fund, UNICEF, said early in March. Reuters Carlos Faria Vladimir Krayushkin lights a cigarette next to a destroyed Russian tank placed in his yard in Malorohan, Ukraine May 25, 2022. Reuters Ivan Alvarado Local residents queue to collect water in the course of Ukraine-Russia conflict in the town of Rubizhny in the Luhansk region, Ukraine June 1, 2022. Reuters Alexander Ermyshenko A police officer checks a home during an evacuation of local residents between shelling in the village of Antonivka, in Donetsk region, Ukraine May 31, 2022. Reuters Anna Kudryavtseva A local resident inspects a flat in Shell Severnai Saltivka residential area in Kharkiv, Ukraine May 26, 2022. Reuters Ivan Alvarado A local resident walks across a street as Ukrainian service members ride on top of a military vehicle in Bayamut, Donetsk region, Ukraine. May 29, 2022. Reuters Carlos Faria. Local resident Natalia Kovalenko, 52, stands inside her apartment damaged during the Ukraine-Russia conflict in the town of Polpasna in the Luhansk region, Ukraine May 26, 2022. Reuters Alexander Ermyshenko. Children play on destroyed Russian tanks displayed outside St. Michael's Cathedral in Kyiv, Ukraine May 29, 2022. Reuters Edgar Su. 
Local resident Larissa, 72, who stayed in a bomb shelter for more than two months, holds a neck piece in the course of the Ukraine-Russia conflict in the town of Rubajny in the Luhansk region, Ukraine June 1, 2022. Reuters Alexander Hermeshenko A man pushes a bicycle near a residential building destroyed during the Ukraine-Russia conflict in the town of Rubajny in the Luhansk region, Ukraine June 1, 2022. Reuters Alexander Hermeshenko a local resident holds a religious image as she stays inside an underground shelter in a town that had been occupied by Russian troops in the outskirt of Kharkiv, Ukraine June 1, 2022. Reuters Ivan Alvarado A local resident writes as she stays inside an underground shelter in a town that had been occupied by Russian troops in the outskirt of Kharkiv. Ukraine June 1, 2022. Reuters Ivan Alvarado